Okay, here's your sway forward, sway back. So you want to make sure that you're keeping the shoulder directly over the hip so that they don't split off. Clear that. And you want to also make sure if you look down here at your feet that your heels and toes stay on the ground. You don't pick the toes and the heels up. They stay firmly on the ground. And then let's look at what it looks like to have the feet stay planted, swaying forward. You can clearly see that I'm leaning this direction. And that would be probably close to center here. And then the swaying back, I'm going a little too far back their direction. You're really paying attention to how that changes the sensation on your feet. Now, if you're not doing it correctly, this is what it looks like. The shoulder will split off from the hip. So that's kind of like a leaning back where you kind of arch your back. And then the other way would be to let the shoulder move out in front of the hip. You want to make sure that that's not happening. So you can see how that would be really hard for you to balance when the shoulders and the hips are split off. We want to make sure that the shoulder remains directly over the hip the entire time you do your sway forward, sway back. All right.